the assignment. Monday is assignment day, where my guest from Friday's photo walk just gone, Marissa Roth, sets a photography challenge or a way to think about your picture making for the next week. It's a, a challenge for everyone. Whatever kind of photography interests you, whatever camera you choose to use, it's really all about the picture that you see. As always, there's a show page on the website, photowalk.show, and I'd love to uh, to share the pictures you make for this challenge, which I can then upload to the show page for this edition. And you can check back, of course, to see pictures from previous challenges and editions. And before we meet uh, Marissa, my thanks to our wonderful patrons and mpb.com who sponsor this show, the number one company in the UK, the US and Europe, with bases in Brighton and Brooklyn and Berlin when it comes to buying, selling and trading used camera kit online. A safe place to do business with guarantees upon what you buy. If you haven't heard the photo walk from Friday Just Gone, you may be wondering why the name of the show has changed from Photography Daily to The Photo Walk. Well, there's a, a more detailed explanation within the show from Friday, but in essence, for a while now, the show's been running under the main umbrella of, uh, of our flagship show, The Photo Walk. And of course, after all the lockdowns eventually ran their course, here at least in the UK, uh, the show ceased to be daily, but we didn't stop. And I was keen to see the show continue, and it was the photo walk that became the flagship show, as uh, I called it a moment ago. So we've rebranded to make life simple to the photo walk, which at the time of this published episode is still filtering through all the cached name changing process. So if you see Photography Daily, don't be too confused. Uh, it will magically change before your eyes in the, uh, the days and weeks to come. Uh, the assignment on a Monday remains, as many of the challenges set are really made for the pictures you make when you're on your travels. Uh, which brings me to today's challenge. I am hoping you may find yourself able to stretch to an audio recording today. Oh, Neil, you're challenging us already. I uh, know. Or a photograph of your notes, maybe. No more spoilers, though. Let's meet our guest from Friday, uh, Marissa Roth. The assignment. So, an assignment. Th this one, you won't really need to take a lot of kit out with you. <laughs> okay. So, one of my favorite photographers is Minor White. Whoa. And an, an amazing American photographer. He was from the East Coast of America, but he was sort of always associated with the West Coast, uh, almost philosophy of photography. Edward Weston, Ansel Adams, sort of incredible black and white nature, but almost he, he could almost turn a stone into an abstract. I hear, I hear so many photographers mention his name. Yeah, to me, he was a poet. Yeah the camera and so he taught at the university level and so usually at the beginning of one of his classes he would tell his students the assignment was and this is my assignment okay um to go out and take a photograph but without your camera so basically you are seeing an image which you then imprint into your mind's eye. How do you bring that assignment? How would how would his students have brought that assignment home to him? Would they discuss it? Would they talk about it? Would it would would they write it down? Would they record it? So they it? would then describe it. So they would see the composition and then they would come back to class, you know, the next class, and then describe the composition. I wonder if um, because we uh, I like people to send the assignments in. In the past, we've had something not the same, but similar-ish, where uh, people have written um, something about something that they've seen. I wonder if it's possible whether people could record their thoughts in audio, yeah. because yeah. that would have been what Minor White would have been listening yeah. to in those classes. So grab an iPhone or a, whatever smartphone flavour you, you prefer. They all have an audio app. Reco yeah. Record your thoughts and send those in. But also make sure, you know, you give the setting, you sort of give it the backdrop and then the context and then, yeah. So as you it. sit there with your recorder, taking your photograph with your eyes, you can be describing it. Have you, have you done this assignment yourself? No, not deliberately, mm. but I have, ha I have, sur I have images in my mind's eye of images that I couldn't get or didn't get. Yeah. Um, I couldn't get 
a car to be stopped or, you know, I was, I remember one I was traveling with a friend of mine when I was younger and she would get so impatient with me while always wanting to stop the car. <laughs> and then I just, I got so tired of being harangued by her, I, you know, and sort of shy about it. I stopped asking. And then there was one day we were in Bhutan and I didn't ask to stop the car and I'm still haunted by that picture. What was the picture? So it was of these actually Nepalese workers. They were almost like on a on a slave labor kind of a level. I mean they were they were there and they were carrying stones on their backs and um, we were driving in a car sort of just through this village and um, I didn't stop. I have some, I have another one from Tibet where it's just, I'm haunted by it. So I can still see the image. And it's interesting because those pictures that I've actually taken, I, I don't retain them at all, even any kind of visual memory. It's almost like the, sp the sports uh, man or woman that misses the shot or misses something. That's the one they remember for their entire career above all yeah. the successes. Right. <laughs> And that's our challenge for this week. I'll be delighted to see what you produce and would love to show them on today's corresponding show page on the website, photowalk.show. Send your files to stories at photowalk.show. Music is from artlist.io. Neil Ford, Emily Renier and Andrea Gilpin, thank you for your work behind the scenes and I look forward to photographing with you, hearing from you and talking with you on the Photo Walk. The assignment is a Loading Zone production.